I wanted to say a few words just in terms of background. I would like to if that's okay. I accepted the invitation to be here with you uh, because your uh, organizer, Andre, uh, really caught my attention and my heart when he told me that he was a community organizer. Okay. I started my career as a community organizer. I don't know how much about me all of you know. I am an accidental developer. I was told that I was the first developer that you folks have ever had a chance to talk to. Well, that's because I'm an accidental developer. <laughs> <laughs> what, what type of positions? I mean, I know that you have a lot of openings for different positions, but what positions are you looking for? What are you talking about? Well, we're going to be hiring everything from ticket takers and concession folks, which are typically you know, opening level positions which either very young people or retired people are employed with. Uh, they're usually people's first jobs. Okay. Then we're also going to be hiring assistant managers and projectionists and cashiers, right, and uh, local accountants and projectionists and the managers, all the normal people that work in the field. And we're probably going to have about 60 employees at that day, security. Yes, there will also be security for them. And there will be the janitorial folk and the cleanup folk. Yeah. And I have figured out if we're going to hire them ourselves or hire a local contractor to do some of these things. And that will be pretty much the call of the local manager. ...layout plan. But so they're building the cinemas. And there, I, I'm correct, there will be stores, um, a complex of stores in the cinema, like right next, I don't know if it was on the side of the cinemas. Uh, I didn't see the initial layout plan, so we can do some clarity on that. So there'll be the cinemas. Yeah, Blackboard will draw for you. Okay. <laughs> so there'll be some cinemas. Well, I have a piece of paper and a pen. <laughs> but, I mean, there'll be the cinemas and then the stores, if I'm correct. And so you said you'll be hiring. Are you in charge of the stores or just the cinema? Like, do you... I'm only in charge of the cinema. Okay. And at this point, the plan for the retail is just that plan. Okay. Okay. Um, there is no commitment yet for the financing for the retail because no one's lending to it. All of the lenders, all of the banks have dried up. And retail is in bad shape right now. And in fact, many retailers are going bankrupt. Okay, so it's driving up the freeway coming up here to Circuit City, going out of business. Yes. You know, linen and towels, going out of business. Okay, a lot of places going out of business. So unfortunately, uh, the retail will probably not be built for a year after the theater opens because the economy's got to come back and retail tenants have to show up so that we can uh, have enough of it be pre-leased so that banks will be lending again hopefully and then we'll be able to. Uh, you, was, you have mentioned that you will hire 60, I'm not saying that 60, uh, employees uh, from the local areas. I'd like to throw this at you and then get a response. We got a, uh, unemployment is a high rate. We got young people who uh, is not working. We got inexperienced people that are not working. Um, what about on the job training? Uh, what are you going to do? Because maybe perhaps you may not, these youth Young adults, young people may not meet the criteria that you set forth for their employment. So, what will you do uh, to help the, the youth, uh, the, the people that uh, from our area, to get hired? Well, I'll ask the city and county what funds they have for training, because I can't solve everybody's problems. Okay, and, and that's your job. Okay. Because I'm only going to hire young people who are respectful, well-groomed, well-dressed, and are going to be respectful to the people who go to that theater. Okay. Because I care about customer service and people feeling good about going. So they're going to have to have a good attitude to begin with. I'm not going to hire kids that are way down the road and need a lot, a lot of help. 
That's for somebody else to do, unfortunately. Okay, but I will hire kids here local. Okay, so I'm going to be looking for the kids that have the right attitude and disposition for customer service. As the development uh, develops, um, will you be able to point us in the right direction to the, uh, to the manager on site so that we can have another meeting with whoever that person is? You figured out how to reach me already. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you'll follow up. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.